Hey guys and girls, and thank you for watching another episode of the PlayStation Tester. My name is Maurice. Today we're gonna unbox the brand new PlayStation 5 Slim Edition. It just came out yesterday here in Euro, and I was really waiting for it to hit um, yeah, the European market. I think it's already been like a month or so that it's been available in uh, the US and I think also Asia. So we're a little bit late, but it's finally here. I also still got my OG, oh my goodness, this thing is still so heavy. My OG uh, PS5, of course, and uh, it would, will still be uh, be used. I think I'm gonna put this one uh, downstairs or maybe in some of the other rooms. And um, yeah, this is the PlayStation 5 digital slim so i bought a digital version because i don't have anything on disc so why pay a hundred bucks extra for something you never use and um yeah it's still sealed so uh yeah, most of the box is the same they still have that 8k logo on it i still find that very funny and um yeah what does it hold it's a let's see PlayStation 5 Digital Edition, DualSense, HDMI cable, power cord, USB cable, some printed materials, and Astro's Playroom is pre-installed, of course. You know what? Let's just open it up. Let's see what's inside. I don't expect a very cool unboxing like you have with the, with the, the Xbox Series X. But it's already a little bit better than the original one, where you just get some uh, egg cartons with it. So it's a white box. And uh, yeah, let's see what's inside. So first thing first. Oh, these are the stands. This is, feels so cheap. You have no idea. So this, these are the, these are literally the stands you use for the PlayStation 5 to put it horizontally. There's no way to put it um, uh, standing up because standing up, you need a extra stand you need to buy for it. So there's your typical standard AC cable inside of it. And uh, yeah, let's open it up a little bit more. It boxed in really poorly. Look at this. This is like really poorly boxed in. So you've got your HDMI. Is it a high speed 2.1? High speed 2.1. So yeah, it is a 2.1 uh, HDMI cable. You've got a small USB C cable to load your controller. You've got a standard PlayStation 5 controller with this system. Nothing special. Well, nothing special. Let's wait a second. No, it's exactly the same. So this is my original one. This is the, the new one. And yeah, they're both 100% the same. I don't see anything different they feel yeah it's it's all the same nothing nothing that that crazy <clears throat> so that's all the hardware stuff inside of the box let's go a little bit further let's see what's inside and here we have the booklets so okay nothing more oh, wait some more booklets Special. And there's the PlayStation 5 with its act card boxes. This still feels cheap. I don't know if you guys ever uh, opened up a play Xbox Series X that's like a, a complete thing to do. It, it has like, it's packed in so beautifully. This is like, yeah, uh, and go. <laughs> it's definitely something else. So, the PlayStation 5 Slim. Well, that's not that slim. It's a little bit slimmer. 
So, here we have it, the PS5 Slim Edition. So we've got a two USB, high-speed USB 3.0. You've got your LA LAN, HDMI, and uh, oh, that's good. Right now you've got two USB-C dongles or uh, things on the, on the front side. There's like a big button here. Overall, yeah, it looks a little bit cheaper instead of more premium than the original one. I'm not sure. And the shiny plastic. So here we have both. Says, oh my goodness, the old one is a way more heavier. So this is the older one. This is the newer one. My goodness, I can't even hold them that long. Holy moly. That's, that's not that, that much difference. I'm going to stand up. Let's see. So, yeah. It's a little bit smaller, but... Nothing that special, to be honest. You see, it's like what three, four centimeters. It's definitely a lot lighter. That's one thing you can be one hundred percent sure about. But overall, I think I think I like the older version better. <laughs> it feels way more sturdy. This one really feels cheap. It really feels cheap. It's a, uh, yeah, I'm not sure what to say about it. You know, it's not that, a little bit meh. Thank you. And it, I don't like gloss. Every time you have like gloss on uh, these systems, it gets to be scratched really fast. So what's else a difference? Um, internally, there's not much different from the original PlayStation 5. So if you already own a normal PlayStation 5, uh, this one is not that different. The biggest difference, I think, between the two is um, this PlayStation 5 has a 825 SSD and this one has one TB. So it has a thousand GB. So it's a little bit uh more yeah you can maybe install one or two games more on the slim than you can do on the original um, ps5 and that's that's actually it there's nothing much different this way you can more nicely see <laughs> the difference between the two this is so cool but yeah you guys this is um the unboxing this is the playstation 5 original playstation 5 Digital Slim Edition, and um, yeah, go check it out. They're both uh, widely available right now. And um, yeah, thanks for watching. Hope you had fun. Hope to see you guys soon in another one. Bye.